Welcome to another video tutorial by myself, Antichristos XIX on IMQ.com and this video tutorial will be focusing on uh, SketchUp 8 and how to set up the uh, exporters that um, are available for you via Camelot Resource Center which is uh, at www.englishtiger.co.uk um, so uh, let's just go into this. I'll be posting all the links that we are using and uh, you can download these yourselves. So on the uh, resource center page, scroll down a bit and you will see a um, SketchUp plugins and files. Click on that and you download the full version of uh, MeshOut version 4.33. Okay, once it's downloaded, just open it up. I'm going to just resize this for you quickly, one moment. Okay, in there you're going to find a readme file. The readme file will tell you where you should be uh, putting the files and um, exactly how to configure the uh, plugin once you have installed it on IMView. Sorry, on uh, SketchUp. So at this point, um, you must have SketchUp already installed, but currently not running on your computer. So in other words, you need to shut down SketchUp before you carry on. So let's go and have a look here. It tells us we need to get the mess out, RBS, that's a Ruby's on rail file. We're going to go and uh, put this out into, um, this, into the default install location, which is usually a C program. Google, Google SketchUp 8 and stuff, and then uh, plugins. And sometimes it is uh, program files uh, and then uh, in brackets x86 which stands for 32-bit if you are on a 64-bit uh, system. Um, okay, so let's go and uh, have a look at where this where it's installed it to. So I'm just going to go grab this. Well, um, first of what I'll do is I'll extract all, so uh, I'll just go and extract all these out. And I'll just put this on the desktop. And let me just quickly switch to my desktop. And here it is, the mesh out RBS. I'm going to copy this. And I'm just going to go into the C drive. I'm going to go into uh, Program Files x86. I'm going to go into Google. Oh, in my one is not in x86. find where I put my one. No, there's no Google folder here. One moment, let me just try and find this for you guys. Alright, here we go. We have a SketchUp folder in Program Files x86. So we open that up. And it's SketchUp 2013. I don't know if this is going to make a difference. I'll go into the plugins. And I'm just going to paste this in here. Continue. Okay. So now let's just switch back to that uh, readme text. And, okay, so we've done this. Now, after, we should relaunch SketchUp, it says. So, let's launch SketchUp now. So, I'm just going to open this from my start menu. Now, this is very important over here. When you're opening up SketchUp, choose Template. Make sure that you're choosing this one. You can go through the list, there's a few of them. But it needs to be product design for woodworking and inches. Okay, start using templates. Okay, I'm just going to scale this down. Uh, just bear with me while I just get this all uh, sorted out. So, sorry about this. Uh, 
and uh, my mic is really crappy. I only have the built-in one in the uh, laptop at the moment, so I do apologize for that. Okay, so now let's see what it said. It said that we would find a new extension. If we go into plugins, and then you should see... Uh, yeah, we should find it over there. Okay, so give me a second. We're going to go into plugins, mesh out. So it looks like the 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 exporter is installed. So uh, bear with me a moment, and I'm going to go and uh, have a look now at what we can do about export setting up a new video to uh, export a file. So uh, let's see. We'll do our first product in the next video. So uh, thanks for watching this one. And uh, give me a few moments to set up the next one.